Look at that. My first moose. <laughs> A lot of folks taking the easy way up. So I'm just about just above the tree line now. Came up that path. Looking east to Breckenridge. Beautiful metal below me. And we keep going up. I think we're about 11,900 roughly here. I didn't look. So, still got a ways to go. I also see some clouds to the north. I have to keep an eye on those. Well, we made it to one of the first fall summits anyway, the first, so I could see these antennas from below. And I was hoping maybe this was the top, but the mountain fools you all the way up there. Um, there's a few other hikers up ahead of me, so um, we'll see what they do. Well, I'm on my way back down. I turned around at 30, 13,000. 120 feet so I didn't make it up to that total ridge there uh, the, the weather's starting to move in yes you might be able to see the sleet coming down and uh, looking towards the northwest yeah we, we see some rain clouds it's raining off and on so uh, turned back by the weather and so it was a really successful hike. I'm, I'm disappointed I didn't make it to the top, but I'm super excited that I made it past my first 13,000 foot hike. So now we're gonna make our way down before the weather gets worse and some thunderstorms move in. Okay. Well, we're back down to 12,570. And uh, got a little bit of sun here, but you can see through the antenna farm there. And we got some more rain coming. So I think it was the right call to come off the mountain. Well, I made it back to 10,500 feet. And the car still here. <laughs> it was great. Um, am I tired? Um, I'm actually doing okay. My knees, however, they're yelling. They're they're upset. <laughs> so we're going to have to go back and uh, put some ice on them, maybe some ibuprofen, and then plan the next one.